Caesar enlists the aid of a neighbor by having her wait with one of the dogs that provokes a violent reaction from Shadow. Right there, yeah. He also asks Alex and Alan to observe from a distance so their energy doesn't influence Shadow's behavior. Hey. White wolf. White fun. Hey. Right there. Stay right there, man. Hey. We end up using instead of the prong collar because the prong collar was escalating the state of mind of shadow. We end, we end up using a very basic uh, approach, which is the leash order when the top can pull up so we can calm him down. Sometimes the tools that you're using uh, might go against what you're trying to accomplish. So it's the same thing we have done in the past with pit bulls and Rottweilers and German Shepherds. This one looks a little bit more primal, more like I'm actually working with a wolf, you know? So you see a lot of more, more gum, you know? It sounds horrible and it looks horrible, but he's just in a dominant state, you know? So you just ride the wave or, you know, you pretty much, this is good, this comes from this state. You can give a affection to that state. Even knowing that the prong collar just frustrated Shadow more and brought him to a higher level of aggression, that was huge. So have you, you experienced uh, the behavior you saw before be yes. with him? Okay. Malamutes, the huskies, the shepherds, all those guys, they just bite and release, bite and release, bite and release. Every time you release, I got seconds over you. So the more he goes, I'll keep my leash up and just wait. I know what they're capable to do, but that doesn't intimidate me. That only prepares me. This is very important. You know, again, he, he went after me a few times. You know? Obviously, he did it before, so we're going to get what, what he shares. Brian, you. <laughs> that was a dominant reaction using his mouth over. Simple as that. So we got to stay there until he, until you see that switch. That he's no longer attacking and he now wants to relax and that's when you that's when I grab the neck, put him in the ground, and then wait for this state. This is very important. This is what they would do among each other. He's still excited. It's a very exciting thing to do for them to dominate and try to get to the target. But see the eyes are going through. We never shown this part because we never had a dog that actually was in a dominant state.